is very orange. Mm -hmm. If the other one comes into view, you'll see that the belly is very white, and the Sumatran tiger does have a very white belly. And also, um, it might not be any more now that I think about it. Oh, wow. um, when we'll we first got video. them, um, the Sumatran was noticeably a little it's bigger than the comes. Bengal because it was a month older. But eventually, the Bengal kitty will go oh. get well over 100 pounds heavier than the other one. Oh. Yeah, just stay real still so we don't scare him. Aww. Just checking you out. Aww. I just want to record you. So. And can you see the little spots behind their ears? Animals that are awake at night tend to have white spots They're behind real their still ears. Good. It's not and gonna animals hurt. that are awake in the daytime tend to have black spots Hi. behind their ears. Oh my so if you ever got this close to a cheetah, you would see black spots behind the ears. I'm and take they it use in. that to look like fake eyes so the predator and prey don't know where they are. And they also think that the adult cats use that to signal to their kids. You know, speed up, slow down, spread out, things like that when they're learning how to hunt. Was it eating something? He's drinking water. Hi. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, you are so precious. Aww. And he knows that we're here. Yeah, he looks like he wants to play with you, going. <laughs> yeah, too bad they're just a little too rough. Yeah. What Aww. a beautiful I'm taking a video and taking pictures. Aww. I wish we could hug you. Oh, yeah. yeah I do. You're gorgeous. Oh, he's looking at you going. You're gorgeous. Yes. He's like, I know. I know. I know I'm cute. I'm pretty cute. Everybody likes me. Yeah, so I'm a real cute kid. You go slow. Oh, he's looking at your tag. He's like, oh, I can play with that. Yeah, is that another tiger? Stand up real slow. I don't want to scare it. He's drinking, so he's probably okay. And you can't see them as well because they're in the next room you. over, but in rooms one and two are Kathy and Debbie, who are our two young Sumatrans. Here, you look. See, tell me if you see him. I'm going to take a video of this one. So cute. I can see your tail. And they will be two birds. years old in January. Hey, cutie. This little guy is still just a little bitty oh, baby. Oh, he's so sweet. What's his name? If this is who I think this is, this would be um, uh, Muka, which in um, one of the languages in that area means chance. And we named Sumatra um, Rekin, which means friend. Yeah, I see. He's like, where'd you go? Where'd I'll come oh, back. back. There he is. He's not going to hurt you, so don't be afraid. Yeah, he can't get through that. No, he can't. Through. This is pretty tough glass. We put the big adults yeah. in here, and the big adults can't even get through. So, especially not the no, I just don't want you to move so quickly. But can you see that little right. alleyway in the back where he came from? That runs the entire length of the building. Oh, wow. So, by opening up the different sections around. back there, we can move a cat from room one all the way down to the other end of room eight. So, we never have to go in there with them. We use that little target, that little colored circle. We walk down the hallway and they follow that little circle to whatever room we want them to go into. Yeah. What a pretty boy. Yeah, it's a pretty boy. He's a good little boy. Yeah, I miss my so kitties. Cute. Yeah. Let me go hug my kitties. Let me miss your kitties too. Let me see if there's a room number four. Oh. Let's see if we can see Teddy. Sure. Bye, sweetie. Bye, cutie pie. Oh, he likes oh, he's you. He's watching gone. you. He's watching you leave. Yeah. yeah. All right. I wish we could play too. We could. I could sit there for hours staring at that cat. Teddy's walking back and forth on the other side. Maybe he'll come. So when he walks back into view, you can see he's way bigger than that little guy is. There he is. Oh wow. Cats have the alley, that means don't go in there. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's the warning. Look. Oh, wow. So way bigger. Whoa. And yet still the Sumatran, so the smallest kind of tiger. Wow. So add 150 pounds to that, and you get what the Bengal looks like. Add that's a little big. less than 400 pounds to that. You can see another one down. Like. Yeah, he's talking to somebody down. Let me okay. go check on this chart. Who it is get, get over here. Stand right along. here. You can see both. Yeah. There's another one down. Joanne. Joanne. Was his mate. Oh, oh yeah. He's Joanne pacing. So I bet Teddy and Malka are talking back and forth to each other about Joanne. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's what's going on there.
Yeah, because I could see the other one way back there, and he yeah. keeps going round and round. There's two, it looks like. So when the females there. are cycling, um, we're going to try to mimic like what happens out in the wild. In the wild, the male owns a big territory, and within that territory are three smaller territories that each belong to a different female. Oh, look. He's so the female.